This Friday night, the Mustang football team will say goodbye to a Mount Vernon institution. First Street Field, Jack Leto has more from downtown Mount Vernon. For decades on Fall Friday nights, downtown Mount Vernon has been bustling. But by about 7 o'clock, just about everybody in the town finds their way here to First Street Field to watch the Mustangs. But on Friday, Mount Vernon will have to say goodbye as the team plays their final game at First Street Field before moving into their new stadium. Yeah, it's an awesome, um, awesome place to play. I mean, the fans are right on top of you because there's no track there, so it's pretty cool, super loud, so it's just a really cool atmosphere. Biggest memory was beating uh, Marion, I'd say, 8-6 to six to knock them out of the playoffs and go to the state. That would have been in 2005. I was fortunate enough to be a ball boy there back in my day. I played football there myself against Mount Vernon. My sons have played uh, football, uh, youth football there. Now I'm coaching there. Before the current Mustangs started playing on First Street Field, they just watched. I just remember always going to the high school games as when I was elementary, middle school, and just you know playing football near the end zones, just watching the games. And there have been plenty of football greats to learn from at Mount Vernon, like Pro Bowler Tristan Wirfs. All Big Ten Hawkeye Matt Kroll. <laughs> and of course, the Mustangs all time wins leader, the legendary Jim Bellamy. I mean, it's awesome just when you'd watch them like walk down just like just like we do. Um, that was who we aspired to be, you know. I mean, we'd be playing football in the end zone, you know. Saying goodbye is bittersweet for the Mustangs. As they close this chapter on some history, they'll also write a new one at a 1500 seat turf field stadium. Oh, I, can't, I can't wait. It definitely looks like a nice field, and yeah, I love playing on turf. I'm pretty excited. I mean, I still got a lot of memories on the other field, but I think we'll make a lot more over there, too. Reporting in Mount Vernon, Jack Lito, KCRG TV9 Sports. You can watch the final game at First Street Field between Solon and Mount Vernon on KCRG 9.2 this Friday night at 730.